You are now watching Tales from the Grid. The opening scene. The inclusion of Mighty Morphin. Lord Zed fighting the Rangers himself, given exposition during a fight. Like I opened up my own cafe. Evil Ollie. Zato getting murked again. Mick getting to suit up again. The Morphing Master is getting captured so easily. Master Red, what the fuck? Izzy's lack of urgency of almost getting shot. Too close. Javi losing his arm. My, my arm. Amelia's lackluster reaction to Javi's severe injury. Billy's morphing sequence looks cheap and unpolished compared to the Dino Fury sequence. Padding the runtime by showing the full morphin sequence. Billy in a blue wolf zord again. More phenomenal. The Cosmic Fury Megazord. A Megazord made out of Christmas globes. It's Christmas ornaments. I'll switch you out with the remote link to Cobra Zord. Zords can be both arms and legs. Amelia talking to Ollie as his girlfriend instead of as his teammate is unprofessional. Cause I don't want to lose you. Crazy. Even with the Zords, we don't stand a chance against that fleet. The tone of the background music undermines how serious the situation is. He'll be cuter when he wakes up. Amelia blurring the line between a work and personal relationship is unprofessional. Jay Borg face down in Flargan Cake while major news is being delivered undermines how serious the situation is. Evil Ollie not being cured after the first try and Amelia jumping into action so quickly. <laughs> Evil Ollie is about that life. How can you be so chill right now? We might never get Ollie back. I am terrified. Amelia is out of line for questioning Lonnie's feelings. The ADR sounds very off and unnatural. Oh, babe, you know just what to say. Padding the runtime by showing the full morphin sequence. Billy's knowledge about tactical strategy. Where are all the other ships? This doesn't feel like Zed. A button that series should be more guarded. Look at how quick this morph was. This shows that full extended morphs were unnecessary. <laughs> I feel bad for that Sentinel. Ollie's still being evil. I'm cured. I can read your mind. <laughs> Zed is Wallen. Once again, Evil Ali is about that life. They couldn't at least make the mark red. But I could be helpful. There's a lot more to clear out of Billy's room if you want to help, babe. Izzy, what the fuck? Javi got that cannon. This power wasn't shown again. Evil Ali has been working on his acting. Love you, Mama Bear. Ion is sharing his loss over his best friend. Amelia's response is only about curing Ali. My best friend is missing. Of course I'm not okay. You know, I miss Ollie, but I'm focused on the hope that one day we'll be able to cure him. And I'm not trying to replace Zato, but I am your friend. Is she talking to Ion or the audience? Zato, that's the red one. I hate that guy. The tonal shifts between evil and comedic undermine how much of a threat Zed is. I kept the dinosaur theme. It just fell right. Billy presenting Morphers to yet another team. The suits look better than expected. Power. But this is Zato's color, and he's our leader. Does that mean he's... Technically, yes, Zato got murked again. If the Morphin Grid chose you to be the Red Ranger, it means it's reacting to something within you. Amelia has taken on more of a leadership role, but also Zato got murked again. That suit does look nice and evil. The morph does look nice and is just as long or even longer than the Dino Fury one. It makes sense to show the extended morph sequence because it's their first time doing it. Amelia is Red Ranger? This is an accurate reaction. The morpher also being a blaster is a nice little upgrade. Ooh, fruit! Ow! Maybe I can eat this? Wow! This was genuinely funny. Ask the forest what happened to Zato. Facts, sometimes they forget that they have that power. He crash landed here. Technically, he got murked again. Hold on. Again, sometimes they forget they have that power. Sword power, now! They really shortened, we need Megazord power, now! To, sword power, now! Zato! Zato has returned. Enjoy the time you have left. Zato has returned, for now. Cosmic shark? Cosmic shark? It's clearly a cosmic swordfish. You stepped up to the plate and held our team together. Facts. Sounds like a red ranger to me. 
T-Rex Fury, Zenith Ranger. The Zenith Ranger is here. You want my girlfriend to pretend to be in a band on a planet of dangerous monsters? Problem not solved. Izzy, what the fuck? S -A -D. This was a nice surprise. This was fantastically shot. Fern is not dumb. Her doing this doesn't make sense. Who is that? Ollie's reaction was funny. The cosmic dragon Zord looks nice. Cause I H A T E, the Emperor of Evil. This is good for Team Morale. There's a Zord battle going on. Babe, I can take care of myself. That's not the point. Izzy, what the fuck? The cosmic dragon Mega Zord looks good, except for that right foot. Nice shot, but this comes off as an ad for a toy because they didn't use the Megazord suit. Billy basically confirms the theory that Zeta was ascending to Morphin Master. That magic's on the level of Morphin Masters. Billy's knowledge about tactical strategy. The blasts are random, they haven't hit us. They're just trying to lure us out of hiding to find our location. Someone on deck, here. Right, Amelia? Izzy, what the fuck? Zord power, now! Blah, blah, Ollie with the exposition. Who cares? Facts. You could see it coming from a mile away that Fern was gonna become a ranger. You blast, right? Fern spun the block for Solon. <laughs> they did Solon dirty. <laughs> the suit looks good on her. She deserves it. Oh, no way. That yeah. is quite the entrance. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Evil Ollie is about that life. I hate this planet. Having someone you know, from another Bright season of Power Rangers make an appearance. Hecka? Bright spot. This was genuinely funny. Have a crush on me? A crush? No, I, I do not. Oh, I forgot one of the main reasons I really like you. You're pretty much unstoppable. Where was this energy the last few episodes? The Dark Ranger makes an appearance. Dino charge. Dark Ranger. It's exposition, but it's short, sweet, and monologuing is part of Heckle's personality. After a classic redemption arc, I became a ranger? Kiss your force field goodbye! He gave away his element of surprise and also said the plan out loud. Remnants of his villain days. The plan didn't work on the first try. Solon telling Zato to cut the BS. Stop. Just tell us. How Ion and Solon address the severity of Zato's situation helps keep the tone consistent. This was fun to watch, and the Zentinel's reaction was genuinely funny. Uh -huh. Find out if that thing is one of ours. Tarek is about that life. <laughs> this was shot very well, and also Billy is about that life. From one ex bad guy to another. Not bad. Someone mentioning that they are reformed villains. Amelia referring to Ali as her boyfriend and making the plan about saving him instead of the world. This will make my boyfriend good again. Padding the runtime by showing the full morphing sequence. Once again, Amelia is putting saving Ali over saving the world and even the Morphin Masters. This plan is a gamble, but it's our best chance to save Ali and maybe even the Morphin Masters. That explosion going off mid sentence was very well done. What are you fools doing in here? Ali taking a deep breath before he makes his move because he understands how dangerous Zed is. Lord Zed is developing tech to turn himself into a Morphin Master! This is their Ultra Zord? A book bag? Cosmic Fury Ultra Zord? Ready! This explosion doesn't look that dangerous. The whole building should have blown for more effect. Ion's reaction to Zato's death. Zato, you can't leave us! Amelia's reaction to Zato's death. Bye, Zato. Ion shows true loyalty, a real ride or die. This upgrade is looking fire. It's Master Zed! Izzy and Ollie's helmets are the only ones with gold on the side. That's inconsistent design. They made their own power blaster. Okay, Lord Zed wow. Lord Zed has been around long enough to know that evil gon' do what evil gon' do. Shaking my head. He's in the can! This was genuinely funny. <laughs> You could tell something was off based on Zato's eyes. Do you know where we are? You were mistaking me for someone else. Ollie's reaction to these OG Megazords making an appearance was very accurate. Oh, look at that! That's some classic Megazord action right there! This officially confirms Zato did get murked, at least physically. I'm afraid that Zato's mortal life is over. Zordon is still alive, spiritually. There's something I used to say in times such as these. May the power protect you. Once again, Ollie's reaction is very accurate. Are you kidding me? 
Zeta was officially a morphing master. Zeta? The final battle being through conversation and reason shows Zed can be reasoned with. You want to survive or not? Fine. Rita Repulsa makes an appearance. Zeddy? Huh? Would you shut your trap? That voice. Rita! Your friendship, it means... It means the world. Now this is a proper send-off. Ion is just out of it right now. It's really cool that he's using Zordon saying as his chorus. Zordons? Uh, how have you got that from me? It's what the being in a voice said to me. Wait. What? This news could give Billy the encouragement to continue his search for Zordon. This was a nice ending. Man power protect you! Cool, cool, coolio. Thank you for watching another episode of Tales from the Grid, and until next time, have a good one.